Hi Pink Angels, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome if you're new. video and that is what I keep in my little pink Michael Kors bag. I showed this bag recently when I bought it and I also posted it on Instagram and I got lots of messages and comments asking to see what I can fit inside this bag because it is quite little and most of my what's in my bag videos I have done are larger bags so I thought this would be really fun to show you guys because I absolutely adore this bag and it, I've had a lot of use out of it already and I've only had it for around a month so I thought I would do a little kind of review and chat about what I keep inside it and I really hope that you enjoy that. So before I get started please do make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel because I would really really appreciate that. My name is Amy and I post beauty, fashion and lifestyle content always involving lots and lots of pink so this is just a really positive happy place on the internet and I would love for you to join and be part of that so please do and also if you feel like it you can follow me on Instagram it's at aloha amy underscore and there's always plenty more pink content on there. So with all that being said let's just go ahead and see what's inside my bag. So I got this bag in TK Maxx and Normally things in TK Maxx are pretty discounted and this was, however it was still one of the more like premium items. It was on the shelves of bags which are still quite expensive so I think I paid around £80 for this bag which I think is amazing considering it's a leather Michael Kors bag, I think that's great. Um, so I decided to treat myself when I saw this because this had been on my Pinterest wish list for like years honestly and I just saw it and thought I need this in my life. It's the perfect colour and it's such a gorgeous shape and I don't have a bag this shape so I thought it would be a really nice addition to my collection. It's got a lovely big long crossbody strap. I just like to kind of wear it like this and I have been getting quite a lot of use out of this. I find it's great for kind of like just running out for coffee with friends or like dates and going for dinner. Just fun things like that because it's quite small and you don't want to be carting around a whole load of stuff but you just need the essentials in here. So that is what I've got. So basically it's just one main zip here and then there's a little pocket at the back, which I'll show you what I keep in here. I just have some like medicines in that little back pocket. I have some peritin for allergies. I have some calms for anxiety and then I also have some paracetamol. So I always keep them in my handbag just because you never know for yourself or for anyone else. You just want to be prepared. And then I also have these Listerine Go tabs, which I mentioned in my previous What's In My Bag video. I love these. These are such a great addition to my handbag. They're like little mouthwashes that you just crunch and then just swallow it and then that's you. You're good to go. So it's really nice and they're really refreshing and they're better than mints because they're much stronger, but I really like them. And then inside, this is what it looks like. So there's quite a lot packed in here and what I've found is that I have a lot more space when I don't take my big purse. So normally I have my big Ted Baker purse. This is my like kind of everyday purse that I carry about but it does fit in this bag but it is quite tight to get in and don't want to stretch the bag and I don't want to ruin my purse. So what I do instead is if I'm going out I will just take the essential cards that I need and pop that into my little card holder and then if I need any cash I can also pop that in here as well. So I have this little card holder which is from Accessorize. I got this years ago and I still love it. I think it's so pretty. Kind of purple holographic kind of colour and I just have like Starbucks card and my bank card and things like that. Just like depending on where I'm going I will pop in the cards that I'll need and then any money. And that I just keep in this little pocket right here. There's one little open pocket here and then a little zip at the back. So I've got that and then I also have my lip gloss that I'm wearing today which is the Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss in the shade Fussy. It's actually almost running out which is so sad so I definitely need to repurchase this. It's my favourite lip gloss ever. I've raved about this so much but it's just incredible. It's just so like glossy, moisturising, it looks so good. It's actually such a nice taste as well. It kind of tastes like like sweeties, pink colour is just beautiful, I love it, I think it looks gorgeous on all different skin tones as well and I highly highly recommend Fenty lip glosses, they're just insanely good. And I've tried a lot of lip glosses and that is by far my favourite. I also have my mirror in here, so this is just a little compact and it's from Kath Gibson and I've had this for years. I really like it because it's quite small. And onto the main pocket I have my little tin of mints, um, so these are in a little mini mouse 
mint tin, which are from is from Disney Paris, but I've eaten all the mini mints and inside I just have some of these little Aldi compliments and then I've also got some chewing gum and I just have that with me and then I have my scrunchie because if I go out and my hair's down I normally do take a bobble with me just because I probably will end up tying it up because my hair does get quite annoying so my satin pink scrunchie is always with me it's either on my arm or in my handbag and my phone in here as well I'm actually getting a new phone today I'm about to order it and I'm really excited so this phone I won't have for much longer but I do love the case so I'm thinking about buying the same case again for this new phone because it's just such a cute case. It's from Coconut Lane and it matches my MacBook case. I mentioned it before but I just I think it's so cute that they like personalise it and then it's also got a really good little phone ring. People are always commenting like when I hand them my phone to look at things they're like this is such a good idea because honestly the amount of times that I've dropped my phone is just it's shocking and <laughs> since getting this phone ring it's made such a difference. So next in my bag is my hand sanitizer and I have one of these in my car and one in my handbag at all times. I'm just always using hand sanitizer and this one is from the like Love Hearts kind of brand and it's so good. I love the smell of this. So it's by Carex but it's the Love Hearts scented one so it's really pretty and pink and it really does smell like Love Hearts. It smells so good like it does actually smell kind of fizzy and there's also a hand wash that you can get that is the same as this. It's also incredible as well, my friend has it and it's so so nice. I have a little breath spray. This one's from m and it's just a fresh mint breath spray. So next in here there's a little hand cream and this one is from Laura Mercier and it's the Tarte Citron one and it smells incredible. Like this smells like lemon meringue pie. It's so so nice and it's a really thick moisturiser as well. I have the matching perfume to this and like a bubble bath and body lotion and things and it's all incredible. Like it smells so so good. I highly recommend Laura Mercier. It's so nice. Um, so yeah, I really love this. Then I have some perfume. I normally like to carry a little rollerball perfume in my handbag because I like to just kind of top it up throughout the day. I am obsessed with Victoria's Secret Scents as you guys know and this one, the bottle is really really pretty as always but this one smells amazing. I love the bombshell scent but this one is just a little bit more kind of like fruity and festive and I really like it. I don't think it's specifically like Christmassy to me, it just smells like bombshell but like slightly different and I just really like it so I've been wearing that a lot recently and it's just really nice to carry around and just kind of like top up throughout the day and then the last kind of thing in here oh there's a nail glue <laughs> I always just carry a little nail glue in case one of my nails comes loose and I want to stick it back on um these ones are from Impress and I really like them but just in case I'm always a bit paranoid especially like when I'm at work and things I always just carry nail glue and then finally in here I have, oh there's a loose compliment. <laughs> Last thing is my sunglasses and these are from Boo Avenue and I absolutely adore these sunglasses. They're the best sunglasses I've found. I have designer sunglasses and I wear these ones more than the designer ones because they're my favourite. So they're just simply from Boo Avenue and I think these might still be available and I think they're only like £5 last time I checked. So I highly recommend getting them. You get them in black or you get them in light pink. I mean, so obviously I went for the pink but they're just so nice. They just fit my face really well and I just really like them. And they have like kind of gold cat eye and they're just very flattering on my face. And I think that even in winter time I always wear my sunglasses just because I feel like it kind of like makes an outfit look more put together. Like when you're wearing like a coat. Just really nice to wear your sunglasses with it. Also I find that when I'm driving the sun can be kind of low in the mornings and you definitely need sunglasses. And then the last thing in here is just in the, the zip at the back. I just have some tissues and a little nail, nail file and then the little booklet that says Michael Kors that the bag came with. There we go, that bag is now completely empty and that is everything that I keep in here. So as you can see, it holds quite a lot. If I put my big purse in here, then it holds a lot less, but if I switch up and use my little card holder instead, it's a lot more practical. I can fit a lot of stuff in here. And to be honest, it's just like the essentials that you need for kind of every day. I can also still fit my keys in here, which is great. And yeah, and if I need to pop in like a little hairbrush or anything, then I can do that as well. There's always still plenty of room. I really love that bag. It's just such a beautiful color. I love the shape and it's just really nice. And I think especially in spring and summer, I'm going to get even more use out of it because it's just the perfect color, the perfect size. 
and I feel like in summertime I just don't feel like carrying around a massive handbag with me so yeah I'm really excited to use it then but for now that is all that I keep in this bag. I really really hope you enjoyed this video and it helped you out if you are interested in buying it as well and yeah thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Mm -hmm.